Now, it's an all-out war between the center and opposition after the appointment of former Judge Nazir as the governor of Andhra Pradesh. The union law minister, Kiran Rijiju, has himself lashed out at the ecosystem which sees this appointment as a reward for the Ayodhya verdict. Remember, Justice Nazir was part of the five-judge constitutional bench which cleared the way for a Ram Mandir. Today, the law minister has tweeted saying, the ecosystem is once again in full swing on appointment. They can no more treat India as their personal fiefdom. India will be guided by people and constitution of India. However, the opposition continues to target both the centre and former Justice Nazir for taking up the appointment so soon after his retirement. So, if you ask me, if you don't ask me, then I understand that this is the king of the king of the king. There is no need for it. The whole government wants to run it. All the tantras want to run it. That's why I have to say that this is the king of the king of the king. The king of 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 the king. What is the other thing? The people who are in BJP have been working for 50 years. Now, no one has been able to do any work. آپ نے اس کو راجے پال بنا دیا میں سمجھتا ہوں کہ پہلے بات تو یہ ہے کہ عبدالنظیر صاحب بہت ایک امدہ جائی تھے ان کے ہاں میرے کو بحث کرنے کا بہت موقع ملا اور مگر پھر بھی میں سمجھتا ہوں کہ یا تو کنونشن ہونی چاہیے اگر سب بھی پارٹیز کا اس بات کے اوپر راضی مندی ہو جائے ایسی باتوں کو سے چھٹکارہ پانے کے لیے ایک قانون ہی بنا دینا چاہیے کہ پوسٹ ریٹائرمنٹ جاب پہلے دو سال میں نہیں مل سکتی کس طرح سے مانی نیادیس کو بنایا گیا اب یہ اگر کسی کو لاہ پہنچانے کے مقصد سے انہوں نے اگر بی جے پی کے لیے کام کیا تو اسے کوئی گورنر کا پد مل جائے तो ये भी उचित नहीं है गवर्नर के पद का राजनीतिकरण नहीं होना चाहिए और ये भारतीय जनता पार्टी का बीजेपी का महामहिम रह के ना बन के रह जाए इसका ध्यान तो रखना ही चाहिए ये महामहिम का पद बहुत ही संवैधानिक दृष्टिकोण से गरिमा का पद है all right, and uh, in the Revolutionary Socialist Party has said that this is creating a bad precedent in the country and will affect the credibility of the judiciary. All the judgments pronounced by Justice Nazir also in question now. It is quite unfortunate that those who are holding constitutional posts after their retirement like governors being appointed, that too in the judiciary, being appointed in parliament, being appointed as the governors, it is absolutely they are creating a bad president in the country, it is not fair at all. This will definitely affect the credibility of the judiciary. Even all the judgments pronounced by Justice Abdul Nasir is also in question, including the Babari Masjid judgment. And Law Minister Kiran Dijuju also hit out at the opposition, saying the ecosystem is once again in full swing on the appointment of a governor. Dijuju went on to attack the opposition, saying that they can't treat India as their personal fiefdom and that India will be guided by the people of India as per the provisions of the Constitution of India. And also, here's an old reminder by the opposition to the center. Congress General Secretary Jairam Ramesh today dug out an old video of late Arun Jaitley, who had once said that pre-retirement judgments were influenced by post-retirement jobs. Pre-retirement judgments are influenced by the desire of a post-retirement job. Former Chief Justice of Jammu and Kashmir High Court Justice Bashir Khan today also questioned the judge's appointments after retirement and said that judges mustn't make compromises for such positions. Lately we have been seeing former Chief Justices falling for small things like a Rajya Sabha seat, deciding a very uh, important and crucial judgment of, for example, Ayodhya a month back and next month falling for a Rajya Sabha seat and now this judge falling again for a governor's uh, position and what's happening now people what are people going to think about it this is what these things are suspicions it is not necessary that uh, it may be a quid pro quo between a Ayodhya judgment and the governorship that may not be the case 
And the BJP has strongly reacted to opposition raising this issue, saying that uh, they must look at their own track record of when the Congress in particular was in power. Congress ko Ramjan Bhumi se kap se pyaar ho gaya. 500 saal se to aur jab ajaad hua us samay se Congress latkate hi raha abhi abhi Kapil Sibbal the. Abhi agar मंत्री परिषद में कोई मुसलमान नहीं है तो प्रश्न उठाएंगे कि मंत्री परिषद में कोई मुसलमान नहीं अगर कोई पार्लियामेंट का चुनाव कोई मुसलमान नहीं लड़ा तो कांग्रेस और सब लोग प्रश्न खड़ा करेंगे अगर कोई योग्य व्यक्ति को कलाम साहब को हमने बना दिया राष्ट्रपति अगर हमने राज्यपाल बनाया तो हम अच्छे लोगों को छूट करके बनाते हैं जो मुझे अच्छा लगता है इसमें लोगों को इतराज किया हम जब नहीं बनाते हैं तो प्रश्न खड़ा करते अच्छे लोगों को बनाते हैं तो उसे ये मानने को तैयार नहीं होते